Hello everyone, welcome back. Thank you so much for joining me. So today I really, really wanted to, I've, I've already done like a little video of this one, but I want to take a look at the Disney and Beauty Bay, um, Disney Color and Beauty Bay? What's the, what's the name of this collection? <laughs> The collection aided together. Now, this was very kindly gifted to me by Beauty Bay. So thank you, Beauty Bay. So we're going to create a little look with that. I have already done a look on my ghost story last week and where I did like a Disney villain vibes. And now I just kind of want to do like something a little bit different. But yes, just before we get into that day, if this is your first time here, hi, my name is Robert. I'm a professional makeup artist here on YouTube and in, uh, and also in real life. And it's my goal to help you become a pro yourself or just someone who's really good at makeup. Um, yeah, so please subscribe if you want to. So this collection came in this incredible box. There are three eyeshadow palettes, there are three lip and cheek tints, and there are six shadow sticks that come in a pack of three. So the palettes come in a little pack like this, a trio. I do believe you can get them individually as well, but listen, let's just, let's look at the palettes because these are stunning. There are three palettes. We have Alice in Wonderland, Dumbo, and The Jungle Book. And each of the color stories, the actual shades themselves, were taken from, um, the original Disney artwork for the films. There's something in my eye and it's really, really annoying me. Oh, my eyes are so dry today. You can see in the back here, it says, this is a Jungle Book one. It says here, um, Baloo's fur, Jungle Tree Trunk, The Sky, The Gira Fur, Jungle Trees, Jungle Leaf. This is so cute. I love this. I absolutely love, love, love these shades. This gives me Halloween palette vibes, like now times, because it's kind of like those, you know, dusty versions of colours. And I think this is my favourite one. This is the Cheshire Cat. It's not Cheshire, by the way. It's um, the Cheshire Cat, I believe, is named after the place in the UK, Cheshire. So it's Cheshire. <laughs> Cheshire Cat. And you have the shades here. You have the Cheshire Cat's face, the Cheshire Cat stripe, the fur. What's this one? Cheshire Cat tree? What? And the eyes. Oh, eyes, tree, teeth. Okay. <laughs> Now this palette, if you're like a Disney fan and somebody was like, just, you know, guess what film this is, you would know straight up, right? This is the Dumbo palette. <laughs> So cute. You have Dumbo Sky, Dumbo Hat, Dumbo's ruffle he's got around his neck, his eyes, ears, and his skin tone. That's cute. Yeah, he is like this purpley kind of grey, eh? Okay, so although this was gifted to me by way, this isn't an advert. I just really, really love Disney. <laughs> and I do already like Beauty Base Formula, which you all already know. They're big palettes. They're like own palettes. Are some of my favourite palettes. So you also have a free lip and cheek duo. And then last but not least, we have these shade sticks as well. They do come in packs of three. And we have that orange tone again, which is the Mad Hatter's face, the same as the cheek and lip. We have a Jungle Sky that matches one of the shades in the Jungle Book palette. We have Dumbo Sky. Then we have a purple, which is a Cheshire Cat fur. We have a yellow, which is Dumbo's hat. And we have that pinky tone again, which is the Mad Hatter's tongue. What a weird shade to choose. What like a weird inspiration. I kind of want to go for like these dustier tones. So let's go for Dumbo Skin, which is this purpley shade. Now, if you haven't used Beauty Bay's own formula eyeshadow already, I would highly, highly suggest it. Um, I really, really like their, their palettes. They're so easy to blend. They're incredibly pigmented. I really need to sort out my eyebrows. They're incredibly pigmented and so easy to work with. And I just really, really like them. You can get like the, the big, big palettes that are so affordable. And honestly, I prefer their formula to some like higher end brands. This is definitely a lot purpler than I thought it'd be. I definitely thought it'd be more gray, but that's fine. I'm not opposed to purple. By the way, thank you to everyone who tags me in any, like, brand's Disney releases. <laughs> when this one came up, everyone was sending it to me in, um, in my inbox, people were tagging me in it. Also, Sigma have that um, Cinderella collection you've all been tagging me in, so thank you, I really do appreciate it, because I do miss, I miss a lot of things. <laughs> right, what is going on with my eye? It's so irritating. I love this colour. You know what, all these, because all these films are, like, vintage films, apart from the Cheshire Cat palette, the the color tones are really kind of like it's high pigment but it's like muted color so it really does give off this kind of more seasonal to to you know to halloween to winter oh i love that color so much i just love it. like that gray gray purple it's beautiful so maybe okay what, what do i want to do i might go into the jungle book palette and take um blue fur which is this shade a little bit through the socket here. Again, the formula, it's just one of those incredible formulas that 
just build so nicely on top of itself, you know? I hate it. I hate it when brands release eyeshadows that you can't actually build up on top of itself. It's like the colors work great alone, but don't dare try to use it with another color, color from the same palette, you know? But these build up very nicely. Love this. Love, love, love this color. I think you know maybe using the light, light blue. Which one is that one? The Dumbo Sky shade, which is this one. Maybe the light blue going into the yellow. <gasps> Let's cut crease. Let's cut crease. Quick. So to make the cut crease, I'm going to use my Beauty Creations Color Base Primer. This is the one that came in, you know, the set that had, um, the collection, sorry, that had all, all the colors in. <laughs> Really, really great products, by the way. I do have a really in-depth cut crease video if you want to see how I do one. It's in-depth to the point of how, what angle to hold your brush at. Okay, so I basically just ruined the whole thing. <laughs> but we can fix it, it's fine. So I'm gonna go in to the Dumbo palette, I'm going to start with the yellow on the inside corner and then move into the lighter blue and then blend that with that deeper grey blue tone. <laughs> That's a bright yellow. Okay, I'm going to use the same brush and we'll go into the lighter blue. Back into the Jungle Pick palette and Baloo's fur. I'm just gonna blend that all in here. Okay, let's get the face sorted out so I can finish up the eyes. So I'm just gonna whack on some concealer and foundation really quickly and then I'll be right back with you. So I'm gonna take the Dumbo Sky Shadow Stick. I'm just gonna go straight ahead and use that under the eye. And then just before that sets down, I was going to go underneath it and just buff it out slightly. That went on super easy, super creamy. And it blends out nicely as well. It's going to kind of set in place quite quickly. So I'm just going to make sure I'm buffing it out. I should have used this to do the cut crease. Mm. We use the Dumbo Skin shade just an outside corner here. And make sure it's like touching that corner. And then we'll do Baloo's fur again. And then just build up that outside corner. So let's go in with the Lip and Cheek Duo. And I'm going to take the cheek side. I'm just going to use my finger. Well, okay, that's... <laughs> <laughs> that's really big on said. Use a little bit too much there, but that's fine. We'll pat in as much as we can and I'll just go over with my foundation brush. Perfect. Oh yeah, I like that colour. It's a really nice colour. I love a good like orangey um orangey blush on me. Okay. So I wanna use the the lip one as well, but I just kinda wanna my lips are looking really red, so I just wanna blank them out a little bit before. Go to the lip side. It's like, it's a bit of an awkward shape to use your lip, but I'm pretty sure. Let's go ahead and use it with my finger. The lip side is a little bit glossier compared to the cheek. So I'm going to use a Beauty Bay highlight and flash. I thought just while I'm on Beauty Bay, why not? Okay, I've got some lashes and liner on. And then we're done with this really cute collection. Okay, so this is our finished look using the Beauty Bay and Disney color collaboration. I just love, love, love this collection. Of course I do because it's Disney and Beauty Bay's formula. But yes, I would absolutely recommend getting these. They're very decently priced as well. These are Beauty Bay's lashes also, by the way. But I, um glued down really terribly. Their eyeshadows are incredible value for money, so absolutely, absolutely go for it. Um, yeah, that's all I have to say. I will link everything down below for you. What else? Um, that's pretty much it. Thank you so much for joining me. You can follow me on Instagram, TikTok, Twitter, if you want to, whatever platform you're on. It doesn't matter if you're not on one. 
don't have to let it be known. Thank you so much again for joining me. I will see you very soon. Bye.